हॅलो स्टुडंट आय एम सोनाली हितेश राव असिस्टंट प्रोफेसर इन सी के टी कॉलेज पनवेल इन लास्ट सेशन वी हॅव सीन एच टी एम एल टॅग अँड बेसिक स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ एच टी एम एल दिस इज द बेसिक टॅग ऑफ द बेसिक स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ द एच टी एम एल डॉक्युमेंट हेड सेक्शन अँड द बॉडी सेक्शन अँड दिस इज अ सिम्पल प्रोग्राम दॅट वी हॅव सीन इन अ लास्ट सेशन सो आय विल इन दिस सेशन आय विल जस्ट पुट दिस प्रोग्राम इन अ नोटपॅड ॲज आय आय ऑलरेडी टोल्ड यू अँड विल रन द प्रोग्राम विल शो द डेमो like that just open a text editor any text editor it is the code that i have typed in this presentation just you have to write the type the code save the file with dot extension file but one thing you should remember that when you are saving a file uh, remember the location of the file where you are going to save that i am just saving this file onto the desktop and giving uh, giving the name first dot html and click on the enter or okay button this is your first html file now next step is to run the html file to run the html file i as i already told you we need one client and client nothing but what you are any browser i have selected internet explorer just go to the internet explorer press control o or open file dialog box go to the desktop where you have save your file go to the desktop and what was the name of our file that was the first dot html look at the file that is a first dot html the symbol or the logo will get changed to the particular web client symbol that is a internet explorer select that file and open the file it is your output of your html file now look at the output whatever we have typed in the body section it becomes the content of your web pages and whatever you have typed into the title section it becomes the title of your pages that's it it is a just demo of our uh, html simple file it is uh, this uh, program we have seen right now now we will go move forward for the basic html tag first html tag is a paragraph tag paragraph tag means what you have if you want to create any paragraph and want to display as it is onto the web page you have to use make use of what a p tag as in earlier session we have seen that is a pair tag non pair tag opening closing tag or singular tag so p and closing p it means what it is what a opening and a closing tag it is also called as what a br tag next one is what a br tag br tag is used to come to the contents to the next slide that is a line break we are come cons uh, your contents will goes to the next line next one is what a hr tag hr tag nothing but what you are a horizontal rule means what if you want to make any horizontal line in the web page then you have to make use of a which tag hr tag next one is what a heading tag heading tag means what just like your font size how much font size font size you want display onto the web page it will start from h1 to h6 next one is a comment tag comment tag is nothing but what you want a contents onto your coding part but you don't want to display that content onto the web page it is just for the developer purpose then you have to make use of what a uh, comment tag next one is what a ol tag and ul tag if you want to display a list type of a data onto the web page then you have to make use of, of a list tag os ol stand for order list ul stand for an order list and next one is nothing but what you are a image if you want to display image because web page is nothing but what a combination of videos images and link if you want to display image you have to make use of a image tag and last one is what a a tag a tag if you want to display a link tag now in this session we have to see we are going to see all these tag with their example the first our first tag is nothing but what you are a paragraph tag the paragraph tag we in this paragraph tag this is the just a skeleton like a doc type html a body this is the body of your html whatever included into the body part will get display onto the web pages so i have highlighted the tag that is a uh, example of the particular example of the particular tag so p tag whatever you have type here it will get display onto the web page as it is so p tag is nothing but what a pair tag we have write there this paragraph till ignore it line so we will see the output and i expected output will be like that whatever you have write here it will display onto the web page our second tag was nothing but was that is a line break line break tag means what if you want to display content to the next line in the web page you have to make use of which tag that is a br tag br tag stand for what a break line break the line so in the our previous program i have continue but in the previous program i have make use of a br tag after the word the 
and before the word number of line again i have make use of a br tag number of line means what on the web page how it will get display the next line number of line again next line in a paragraph now we will see the right because we have to we, we have make use of what a break tag number of line again we have make use of what a break tag means what your content will display to the next line our third tag was nothing but what you are a hr tag hr tag means what a horizontal rule horizontal rule means what a uh, just have a horizontal line onto the web page i have make use of this hr tag just same one same two after same three same four and after same five and same six rest of the program part is the same so output will be same one same two same three same four same six and same uh, same five and same six horizontal tag we have applied that's why that horizontal line has come okay next one is nothing but what you are a heading tag heading tag as i already told you heading tags used for what a font size you know any word five we are specifying the size eight 12 means what as you increases the number now so font size will get also increases if you want to display such type of a font if you want small size you have to make use of a h6 if you want to big size font you have to make use of a heading so now you can see the output here only that is heading 1 included there so heading 1 tag we have enclosed in a h1 tag h1 tag is uh, it, it is a biggest tag and second one is what a h6 so h6 means what a it is a smallest tag in the web content so heading 6 comes into the smallest h2 h3 h4 h5 and h6 total h1 to h6 six tags are available in the html next one is what a comment tag comment tag i already told you the purpose of comment tag is what if you want to write a program it is just for a developer purpose to understand what exactly program is it will not display on to the web page means what it it does not include it on to the web content so this is your program i have included this another paragraph into the comment section the syntax or the tag of the comment section is what is this symbol tag exclamatory sentence two lines next one whatever you want to include into the comment and close it and then close then close the tag it is the comment section now you see the program this is the paragraph it display on to the web page again this is another paragraph have you seen this another pa paragraph on this web page no because it is included into the comment so it is not going to display and third one is what a this is a paragraph 2 is also display on to the web page so it is that is the purpose of your comment tag next one is what a order list and an order list i already told you if you want to display a contents on to the web page in a list wise then we have to make use of what a list concept there are three types of a list that is a order list an order list and the data list first one is a order list order list nothing but what you have to display a content like a serial wise 1 2 3 4 a b c d then that sequence man if you want to display the content then we have to make use of what a order list order list you have to uh, make which tag that is o l tag o stand for order l stand for list in this order list we have to make use of it is a nested list that is a l i l i stand for what a list item list item means what you in order list you have to include which type of a list which data you have to include list item you have to include that in enclose in a li tag so i have included coffee tea and milk now look at the output and order list html list as it is display next one is what a coffee tea and milk display but before that list there is a numbering that is 1 2 and 3 by default html content uh, Yeah, for order list is a one, two, three, four, five. If you want to change that, like a Roman, then you have to specify. Next one is what a an order list. Same, but it is not in a sequence manner. I have specify a list coffee, tea, and milk, but enclose in a ul. But in this session, in this program, we have specify the style that is a circle. Means what your list display into the circular manner. You can change like a solid circle. You can change like a square. so your display your uh, list will get displayed to the coffee tea and milk next one is what a description order list description order list means what one list under sub list then it is called as what a description order list for this purpose we have to make use of a dl that is a description list under description term okay so that is a coffee but coffee is nothing but what either black hot drink 
और मिल्क वाइट कोल्ड ड्रिंक ओके तो वॉट इज वॉट इज एक्सपेक्टेड आउटपुट आउटपुट इज लाइक दैट कॉफी नैन ब्लैक हॉट ड्रिंक मिल्क वाइट cold drink it is nothing but what you are a description list we have basic two term that is a coffee and milk under coffee we have to mention what a black and hot that's why we have to make use of what a description list next one is what a link link nothing but what if you want to display if when you go, go for a google you will have a link that in, in a blue color it does a, it it means what you have connected the, that link is connected to the particular web page for linking purpose we have to make use of what a anchor tag anchor href that is a reference tag you have to specify the website name and the output will be html link when you click on this website or click on this link you are going to the google.com website next one is what a image tag image tag is used to display image on to the web page for this purpose we have to make up may uh, make use of which tag image source source is nothing but what your path of your image in the current system where you are typing the program so it is the name of the the flower in a china is a name of the alternative name of the image if that image is not display on to the web page next one is what a uh, this is about our uh tax related uh, related to the html programming i hope student you understand everything basic tax in html so in next section uh, in this session we have seen a basic html tag which are tag we have started tag from the comment paragraph tag br tag next one ol li and image and the link tag i hope you understand thank you very much